I'm Emily Ann Page and you're watching Start to Sold. Sometimes sales is about numbers. That's the place we start. It's all in the mind. But sometimes the highest value is about emotion. It truly is because you have to convince a person that this is a worthwhile investment, that it's going, it's on its way up. How much does it cost for you to get that first sale? Think about it. And if you have a CFO, ask him or her to do the math because you should be able to calculate a cost to acquire a customer. We're gonna be talking about what it takes to go from zero dollars in sales to a million. I've done it a few different times and humiliated myself on the way, which is kind of what it takes to get to a million dollars in sales. So if you're wondering if feeling like an idiot is a normal thing, you should come and I'll share some exciting stories about how that's okay. It's okay to feel like an idiot. talking to your ideal customer, you will learn about opportunities you didn't even know existed, which means you could have more opportunities to solve their problems, which means you could have more opportunities to grow your revenue, which is why you have to calendar time. What you focus on will grow. Let's grow that customer who's always been awesome and possibly that person will also have referrals to similar companies. I don't like failing. I get very upset when I have an ambition or goal and I fail. Those failures though have created massive awesome pivots towards something better and if I spent less time feeling sorry for myself or misinterpreting situation making it the worst case scenario and recognizing hey winners lose that's how you get to be a winner understanding that failure is actually an everyday occurrence and it's natural and healthy and important if you aren't failing then are you even trying